Welcome to a demonstration on backing up your company's data in Sage Simply Accounting. This presentation is presented by iAccountingTraining.com and its sister site, SimplyTraining.ca. Performing a backup of your company's data should be part of your daily routine and best practices in your company. We will demonstrate the steps on how to prepare and perform a backup of your company data file. You will learn what a backup file is comprised of where to access backup settings in Simply Accounting. We will then demonstrate how to complete a backup and share tips on naming your backup file. And last, we will provide information on what not to do. Before we get started, let's understand what we are backing up. Backing up your company's data file, it creates a copy of your company's accounting transactions and information in Sage Simply Accounting. A backup is comprised of a file of your company data and includes both the SAJ folder and the SAI file. Now let's move to Sage Simply Accounting and perform a backup. Before we get started performing a backup, let's go and review the backup settings that are available in Simply. These are found in the company settings in the setup menu. I've selected Setup and go down into Settings. Under your company settings, you will see the backup window. In the backup window, you can set settings for reminders and also to compact or verify your database. Also in this window, you can schedule a backup. Let's select OK and now go on to Performing a Backup. To open up the backup window, there is an icon in the toolbar at the very top that says Backup. We can click on that and that will open up the backup window. Also, you can access the backup window from the File menu and select Backup and also from the Data Management icon. So let's go into the Sage Simply Accounting backup window. The first time that you perform a backup, the file name will come up with the word Backup. We do not recommend that you name your backup file backup each and every single time. The next field down is a location, and this is the location where you would like to save it on your computer. We recommend that you create a file folder under your Simply Accounting information. And last in the comment section is a comment about the company data that you are backing up. Also in this window, you can select to compact your database before backing up, which will save space, and also to verify the backup file after backup completion. We recommend that these two selections have been selected. We also mentioned of what not to do, and is to backup over an existing file. I'm going to demonstrate that first. The default file name pops up as backup. If I select OK to back up and we already have an existing file back, backed up under that file name, Simply Accounting will come back and identify that you already have a file in this name. Displayed on your screen, it states a backup already exists on this disk with that file name. Do you want to continue the backup to override this backup file? it is not recommended to override any other backup file. So I'm going to select No, and it will identify that this time the backup of your data was unsuccessful. We are back to the home window again with the Sage Simply Accounting backup window still open. So let's start all over again, and let's name the file name, a unique name. So we're going to name this our company name, and also we can give it a unique date. So I'm just going to name this January 2nd, 2012. By giving the, comp the backup file a unique name, you can identify each day that you have performed a backup. Again, make sure that your selection of your backup file and location where you would like to save it to on your computer. Simply Accounting will automatically adjust the comment. You can put a different comment in if you prefer. So once when we've given it a new file name, we've selected the location, 
click OK to perform the backup. When the backup has, com has been completed, you can see on your screen it will identify that the backup is complete. Click OK in this window and Simply Accounting will return us back to our home window. Now let's return back to our PowerPoint for more information about backup storage solutions. As we mentioned earlier, performing daily backups is very important. Also to keep backups stored in a minimum of two locations, one on your computer and the other on an external drive and taken off-site of your business. Also recommended to use is an online backup storage service and a few are identified on the screen. This concludes the presentation on backing up your company's data in Sage Simply Accounting. We hope this video has provided you with relevant how-to information. Please take the time to visit our website, iaccountingtraining.com or simplytraining.ca for information and training courses on the Sage Simply Accounting program and other relevant courses. Thank you and take care.